total war have Urbe Conditumod playing as the Romans. Let's activate our scripts. Ready ho. Uh, let's send our spy down here. These Greek settlements do not look very well defended. There's a good sized force in Orissa. But I'm thinking that we should come down here and start raiding some of these Greek settlements. And I think we should do it with some artillery. Some big powerful artillery. The ballistas and scorpions won't be enough. But these stone throwing siege ballistas should be. I don't think we can get any bigger artillery than that, can we? Siege engineer. Ah, the Lephobolos. That should be even bigger. How effective are these against inaccurate against troops? Very long range missile. Attack versus buildings at 70. It's still good against troops if we can actually hit them. Alright. We are retraining all of these forces here, which just came back from um, Greece. That's a lot of forces right there. It's probably an intern. And in fact, we are being attacked there. Now, we may not win this. That's 4,000 plus men there. However, if we do win, that's going to be pretty much all of the Greek forces that we can see. We could probably push out with this army against these. Right. You do actually have some cavalry in that army and some missile troops. can see them, they're all spearmen. Ah oh, yes, Theodecles, don't we owe you a very painful death? I believe we do. Alright, we shall try to fight them. We don't have the best formed army. Uh, we've seen the Greeks can easily beat our Astadi and Trinkopes. We don't have well, basically any cavalry, very little missiles. But we shall do what we can. Even if we don't beat them, I think we'll inflict quite a few casualties on them. And once we start taking out their other settlements in southern Greece, that's really going to hurt them as far as recruitment goes. Now, I don't like this map. Puts us in a very bad position. We only have one Hastati, do we? Seriously? Alright. We'll come up along here. You're going to have to go on to fire at will. We only have one archer. Only one cavalry. This can be one of those battles where the Greeks actually outnumber us in cavalry. Right, you can just sit back here. Start the battle. They have. They have indeed. However, Only one of their armies has come in. One of their other armies has been delayed. Right. Let's 
get our skirmish troops out so that they can go and skirmish. You can see the other enemy army coming in back there. Get our triarii over here. They're going to actually have to defend against the enemy cavalry. It looks like. Go ahead and blow your horn. Nobody quite within range. We are on skirmish mode, right? Yep. Those are heavy cav. It'd be nice to get rid of them. Where's their general? Back there. Okay. The Greeks are actually going to be more mobile than we are today. I wonder if we can even get them around to attack the enemy general. I mean, do they have 49 in there? And there, they actually managed to disappear. Huh. Every cab can disappear into the trees. It's not even very thick trees there, is it? I'm getting javelins into the back and the flanks. Didn't do too much damage, though, did it? I'm sending some hoplites to chase us away. Uh, go and use up your last javelins on those. Right. Actually, get off of fire at will. You as well. You're going to use up all of your ammunition on those worthless Spell tests. We want to be using our javelins on high value targets. Alright, we've gotten rid of those uh, spell tests. Now you can go back on to fire at will. You might be able to take out some skirmishers. That in. Those enemy reinforcements are getting very close though, aren't they? Uh, I think you actually need to hold back. Just get off the edge of the battlefield. Away from the enemy units. Until we find a better time to use you. Alright, you've used up all of your ammunition. You can come back behind our lines. You might be able to pick off these two units. Combined, they have less than 40 men. And you can come off of skirmish mode. You are in rather a thick formation. Well, it stretches you out a little further than that. How are you actually doing? All right, their other armies come in. Luckily, they're also very far away. Uh, 
Uh, let's target the Thorakitai because they have javelins. Doesn't look like they want to engage our actual forces. Are you going to win over here? Yeah, you are, eventually. Just keep firing away at them. Panic by fire attack. That's good. Shaken. Now uh, target those. There's a big blob of enemy units there. Let's deploy you over here. They may try to sneak some of their cavalry through. Don't see anyone we can pick off. They're staying in formation. Nice big blob. Yeah, that cavalry unit's pushing up onto our flanks. They're going to head straight into our triarii. Alright, blow your horn. Ah, there's one of their generals. Was that... That was their starting general. Ooh, okay. Uh, we're not going to get away from them. They're heavy cav, we're just skirmish cav. So they're going to beat us. However, it's okay. We've done enough damage, I think. 21%. Our main line is still holding. Alright, stop. Stop running. Stop running. And they're going to get hit in the flank. I think it's time to be aggressive and hit the enemy. We've got enough units that we can stretch them out and still cover. Uh, the whole line. I think our general is going to have to get involved there. That's what's remaining of their general. No, actually, that's their second general, I think, isn't it? The enemy general is slain. Yes, Theodicles, we got him. And I think it was our general who killed him. So that's good. Right. We're doing okay. We may take out two of their armies. In fact, we lost some Prinkapes. Ooh, you need some help over here. You may get into my archers. Who's that? Heavy Cav. get you some help. Blow your horn. You look kind of old, so it might not be too bad if we lose you. Yeah, we actually broke. Let 
general's unit over there. All of these units are now breaking. If only we had a little more cavalry, we could have decimated them. All right. They did manage to get a couple of units over here. That general's bodyguard is coming back for another shot. That's their reinforcing army, their second one. We may, in fact, uh, I think we need to stop chasing those units and reform. A general can go after them. All right, you do need to deal with that unit. But you, you should reform. And including you. I feel confident we're now going to get them. Their whole force, those three armies. That last reinforcing army only had infantry in it, I believe. where we are forming up over here how are you doing general these routing units yeah they've already left the field we're not going to catch up to them all right general you can go after that unit I'm pretty sure they didn't have any missile troops apart from the Thorakitai And we have killed off that army. We definitely have enough troops now to envelope them. Alright, let's be a little aggressive with them. Let's go and attack them. See what we can do. We killed off sixty five percent. 
you're not going to do too much against those Thorkipo, but you are hitting them in the flanks. Right, there's their general's unit. It would help to kill them off. Who managed to catch you? Right, those light spearmen. Those are broken. You come over here and hit them in the um, rear. We may not beat them, but we're definitely going to inflict a lot of casualties. And with our generals still alive, we might be able to rally some units. So come a little closer to the action. Uh, wavering. Yep, we may not beat them. Although they're shaken. And that's an elite unit of the enemy. Right, we did break them here. Wonder if any of these units will come back to the fight. I mean, that's like eight or nine units over here. We could definitely use uh, seventy-eight percent, and it was four thousand plus men that they had. Who's over there? They haven't broken. Let's see if we can kill them though. They've broken. Doesn't look like we're going to have enough troops to pull it off. Alright. Uh, withdraw. And get out of there. Exit battle. Yes. Close to feet. We did kill 3,350. Hmm. I think we did pretty well considering it wasn't the best formed army that we could have had lacking in missile units and cav we do have a lot more money now don't we right we've lost a family member in Vibracti we recently lost one in Dariotium but we have got a coming of age in Vienna, it's close enough. We can send you to Bibracti. As far as construction goes, Suggestica, you're making over 3,000 now. It's nice. And your army, we're sending these barbarians over. 
tough you and we need something to make you happy. There wouldn't be too much unless we just keep recruiting out of here. Right, those are probably just all armor upgrades. Same over here. You've got a lot of uh, archers, don't you? I think we're lacking uh, cavalry, two, three units there, none there, none there, none there. How much are the cav? And now we have our stone throwing siege ballista. Let's start sending them down. A lot of recruiting. Right, Vienna, let's see anything we can construct there, the Bracti. We'll improve the sanitation. Alright, and we've done all of that. We do have these units that we're sending over. And we did have this army that's forming up over here. Let's get some... Cavalry into that force. I think a couple of archer units and heavy infantry. And you're ready to go. So there's some retraining to do there. Right, so we're blockading that settlement. We don't have anyone here ready to move. All right, where do they all have 159? Ah, were they besieged? That must have been what happened. There you go. Or merge up where you can. So um, we have a general here, don't we? Secundus Potus. Let's give him this army. Let's push towards Pella. That's a large city. Any cheap mercenaries? We'll send you into Ambrosia. Right. Now that is only a town, but it will link up our territories. So if we take Pella, that's going to cut off the southern Greeks from the northern Greeks. And that is a very important city. So I think that's where we're going to leave it for this episode. Until next time, thank you all for watching and we'll see you later.